वेलकम टू द थीम ऑफ क्वांटम कंपुटेशन वर्क दैट आई आई हैदराबाद फ्रेटर्निटी हैज़ बीन वर्किंग फॉर द डिफेंस एप्लीकेशंस वन इज़ द कंपुटेशनल एस्पेक्ट्स एंड अंदर इज़ द डिवाइस एस्पेक्ट्स सो हियर वी हैव बीन टेकिंग ऑफ दिस पर्टिकुलर वर्क फॉर लास्ट फाइव ईयर्स एंड वी मैनेज टू प्रूव थियोरिटिकली एंड एट द सेम टाइम कंपुटेशनली दैट द यूनिवर्सल लॉजिक गेट कैन बी इम्प्लीमेंटेड यूजिंग द नेक्स्ट जनरेशन नैनो मैग्नेटिक लॉजिक एंड देर वी हैव अडॉप्टेड द dipole based mqca that is the magnetic quantum cellular automator then what happened that once we have the universal logic gate then based on that we managed to demonstrate that the addition and the multiplications are possible and with that the biggest finding there was the convolution the moment you can do the convolution using this magnetic quantum cellular automator then the entire domain of deep neural network would be uh, explored by this alternative domain our group is working in the field of uh, new information processing based technology based on magnetic waves uh, magnetic waves process frequencies in the gigahertz range and we look into their properties uh, using techniques like broadband ferromagnetic resonance and we try to image them uh, using uh, uh, some microscopy techniques so here we have a broadband ferromagnetic resonance experiment where you can see the electromagnet we place our magnetic samples or thin films or nanostructure in between these magnetic poles we have a high frequency source over here and the data we record using a uh, computers over here we can use their amplitude and we can use their phase for the processing uh, of information that gives additional advantages compared to the existing technologies such technologies will be very useful uh, in drdo uh, defense based applications In our spintronics materials and device group, we explore the spin property of the electron in addition to the charge for data processing and data storage. Spin-based technology has several advantages over the conventional charge-based devices. They are non-volatility, zero quiescent power, high speed, and uh, low power consumption. And most importantly, they are radiation hardness, which is very much important for the defense applications for DRDO. So here we have a two-chamber magnetron sputtering system with eight. Uh, Uh, sputtering guns where we can do dc and rf sputtering to create magnetic multi layer structures which of uh, nanometer thickness and this uh, technology is already being used in cmos uh, integration where we can scale up to 300 mm wafers i believe that with the help of this computational background that we managed to establish so far and with the collaboration with the device physicists who are around here in iit hyderabad the, and also the material science and engineering faculty we should be in a position to uh, demonstrate the full fledged system which would be unique and especially in the defense applications this can turn out to be one of the biggest discoveries in this near future